Good evening. So glad to have you here on this Monday. I'm Brendan Clark. Good evening, everyone. We are glad you're watching. I'm Carol and Murray. We begin with developing news tonight. Fire crews working to remove smoke from a house in downtown Charleston that caught fire this afternoon. Happened on Reed and America Streets. That's where we find News 2's Riley Benson. Riley, you heard from fire crews tonight. Yeah, Brendan Carroll, and this is still an active scene here on Reed Street in downtown Charleston. You see this white house close to me in the greenhouse. These two houses involved in that fire that started about 2.30 this afternoon in downtown Charleston. Now officials say no injuries are reported as a result of these two fires. But again, this white house close to me receiving the most damage from this fire. It has now been put out at this point, no smoke. But again, officials do remain on scene. This is an active scene at this point. Now, I want you to take a look at some of the video we were able to get earlier when we arrived on this scene. You can see some of that damage a little bit closer. You can also see the crews that are here responding. Now, again, this fire broke out just about 2.30 this afternoon. The Charleston Fire Department responded to it. Now, the White House was unoccupied at the point of the fire. The greenhouse did have some occupants. They have been displaced as a result of the fire and the damage. It started in this White House. Uh, smoke and conditions here kind of push that fire to the greenhouse, the neighboring fire. We did have a chance to hear from Mike Gelazzo at the Charleston Fire Department here just a short time ago. He kind of described some of the events from the fire and what crews saw when they arrived here on scene. Our crews were able to get in and initially make attack inside the structure and started to control the fire while searching the building. Unfortunately, they were pushed out very quickly due to the amount of fire and volume of fire in the building and they evacuated and moved to a defensive strategy. Crews were able to contain the fire. Uh, no one was located in the structure. We do believe the structure was a vacant building at this time. And now, like again, I mentioned this fire pretty much out of this point. We haven't seen smoke. Crews seem to be packing down their equipment. They are still active here, though, on Reed Street. Uh, again, we'll bring the very latest. No injuries from the South Fire that broke out just about 2.30 this afternoon. For now, reporting live in downtown Charleston, Raleigh Benson. Count on two.